Good morning, children. Today, I'm going to start the fifth lesson, Precious Water. What is water? Water is an inorganic, transparent, tasteless, colorless, odorless, chemical substance. No one can live without water. Ocean, sea, river, lake, ponds are all made up of water. Next, children. Why water is useful to us? Why water is useful to us? Water helps to keep your body temperature normal. You need water to digest your food and get rid of waste. Plants and animals too need water to survive. So next we are going to learn what are the sources of water. What are the sources of water? In sources of water we have to divide in two. One is the surface water, other is the ground water. In surface water we have lake, pond, river, stream. And in ground water we have open well, tube well and stream. Next, first we will see the surface of water. Lake. Lake is a large, uh, lake is a large body of water surrounded by land. Pond. A pond is a body of water which is smaller than lake. A stream. A stream is a natural flow of water moving across the country between banks, which is smaller than river. A river is a stream of water which flows through a channel in the surface of the ground. Now let's see the ground water. What is in ground water we have open well. An open well is a simply hole in the ground that allow excess of water underground. Next is the tube well. A tube well is a type of water well in which a long pipe or tube is bored into the underground. Spring. A spring is a point where water flows out of the ground. A spring may flow the whole year or only for some times. Next we will see why is water necessary for drinking. Water is necessary for drinking because it helps to maintain the body fluid and this fluid include digestion, absorption, circulation for the maintenance of body temperature. Storage of water and its uses. Dam. The water stored in the dam is used for irrigation, agriculture, drinking and to generate electricity. Dam also helps to protect us from flood. Tank. Tank is a container in which we can store large quantity of water which can be even used for agriculture, irrigation and for drinking. The water tanks used at home are used for drinking, bathing, washing, cooking, cleaning and watering the plants. Water is necessary for plants and animals. Plants need water. Like all living things water, to stay, grow and to stay alive, plants need water. Plants, you can see the picture, plants with water and plant without water. Next, animals too need water. Animals need water for their body to function. Animals gain water not only by drinking the water, but through the food which they eat. Develop this habit and protect your health. Children, always drink clean water. The container in which the water is stored should be covered. And do not put your hand to the container in which the water is stored. Always use a cup with a long handle. And always drink boiled and cool water to protect your health. So children, through this lesson we learn that the water is very precious and we should always save the water. Thank you.